thanks for tuning in. My name is Paul. I'm a restoration person here at Battleship Cove. And today's video is going to be basically we're going to organize a 16 inch powder magazine. The cans have been recently acquired some new ones. We have a whole bunch of old ones down there, but it was never really organized properly. So myself, along with another volunteer here, Tom Lowney, who actually did this in the Navy. He was a gunner's mate. We're going to go through and make it a proper exhibit and make it proud to show off to the public and have everyone like what we do. So please follow along and thank you. <laughs> Get out of my silly when I'm tired. No. You messed it up. You fall off. That's it. That's it. What about that one behind it? Part for now. Yeah. That's why it's not notched out. I wonder if that one's the one that goes over there. Oh, wow. It looks the part. Yep, they match. Okay. This is a 44 and a 44. 
pick it up. These ones don't have dates around the cans. Sure. Huh. Pick it up and put it in. Yeah. Good. Hang on. Looks like it was designed for one more because you have these. Yeah, I noticed that. 40, 40. Do I want to block the light? Oh, yeah, that's a good point, too. Yeah, leave it that way. It's gonna probably be the stopping point for me anyways because I got a jet. You gotta go? Yeah. Alright. Well. Made a hell of a dent. Yeah. Well, worst case, we could always finish this off Monday or Wednesday night if you're by. Yeah. I'm gonna pass you out of the top. Hmm? The abortion mark too. Over there maybe. And the other reason, two, four, fill this rack up. You can't get through. Yeah, bingo! <laughs> I thought about that one after the fact. I thought about that one after the fact. I mean, you could squeeze through here and crawl under the cradle, or the other side of the powder cans you can go through. 1940. Cap. 40? Yep, 40. Oh, okay. Thought you wanted a 40 cap. <laughs>
over? No. No. Finish off the rest on Monday. to keep the lights just in case. It is a vast improvement. stack <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be the question <laughs> when I post it online <laughs> hey, what's wrong with this picture <laughs> Yeah, for now. We're just going to be going back up there Monday. Somebody 
Ready for designing a handle that way and a <laughs> latch. <laughs> All right, you keep me in good faith with the wife there, brother. <laughs> yeah, mine too. <laughs> I didn't notice I got a message because I have no reception down here, but he's like, you'll be home by five, we want to play games tonight. I'm like, ah! See, at least they got this right. See the bar? Yep. Oh yeah, the J-hook. Then I go, I say we take the other cans. I'll have some there too, yeah. Can you want to turn your GoPro off? Huh? Kill the GoPro? Eh, it's still going. Still going. I don't see any pictures posted from you from those. Pictures. What do you mean pictures posted? Can you, can you pull pictures out of your videos? I can do stills, yeah, when they play. I gotta comb through all the hours of footage I have and actually get some of it uploaded to YouTube. Really? What the hell? Who even pulled that out? Locked open? Yeah. So it's not, it looks like a muscle. It's a flotilla. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, you can say that it's a flotilla. <laughs> <laughs> Are you spitting on the swans? Want a diet coke for the road? Huh? Want a diet coke for the road? Nah, I'm good. You know, I wish there was something. I'm 
I'm tired of arguing with stupid. I gotta change my sneakers and boots here. Alright, I gotta head out because I gotta be back, so. But. GoPro still on. Yeah, I know. I'll turn it off when I get to the Jeep. If you like what you saw here in our videos, please feel free to like and subscribe to the videos as well as follow us on Facebook. There'll be a link down in the description for that. And if you live nearby or in the Fall River area or live somewhere in Massachusetts and you actually want to help out and like what we do here and want to actually chip in, we're always willing to have volunteers. You can go to our website, which will be linked in the description again, and fill out a volunteer application and come down here and we'll show you what we do and find a good place for you and figure out what you want to do to help restore the Massachusetts or any other ships we have here at Battleship Cove. Thanks again.